What's up, followers? And today you're welcome to another edition of the Kings TV's Whole and Smooth Man. Today is very exciting. I'm representing Alpha Beta Records. Shout out to Salatia, Ironman General, Mr. Leo, Blaze B, Big Joe, all of the Alpha Beta team. CP loves you, Kang Steven loves you. We take another shot, loves you. Okay, so today I'm gonna be showing you a very, very important secret before color grading. A very, very important secret before color grading. I know you want to know that secret, so stay put to the end because I'm gonna amaze you. So for those who haven't liked, just go ahead and like the video. For those who haven't shared, you can share right away because you're not going to regret it. For those who haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe for more videos on this channel. So let's go. So the most important secret before color grading an image on your monitor is calibration. Yes calibration you don't want to color any music video any film on your monitor without calibrating the monitor I know you've been facing some kind of problems where you color your videos it looks very good on your monitors and then when you play it on another screen it looks like what the f is happening you know that's the problem you didn't calibrate your monitor so today I'm gonna walk you through on how to calibrate your monitor with spider 5 pro Spider 5 Pro is a calibrating system which helps to calibrate your monitor for color grading so you can have accurate colors. I'm not doing any publicity for this, I'm just sharing the idea so you guys can do that. Okay, so it's actually a very cheap calibrating system. You can get it for I think $150 or $200 on Amazon. It's very, very cheap. You just go ahead and get yours and calibrate your monitors before color grading. Okay, so I'll just walk you through to the computer where I'm going to show you how to calibrate your monitor with this baby. So let's go. Okay, so this is a Spider 5 Pro. It comes like this. You open it. You have the machine inside, so you just open them, take it out. It's small like so, but it's very powerful. It comes along with a serial number, so when you're installing the program for the first time, you have to put the serial number. I'll put the link on the description box below when you, where you can have the software of this product. So, just launch the program, it comes like so. You click OK. You want to first of all ensure that your screen has been on for at least 30 minutes. Secondly, you want to make sure that no hash light is flashing on the screen of your, of your computer. You want to also make sure that you've adjusted everything to default, like the, 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 the screen settings to default. You want to keep everything on default. So the next thing you want to make sure you do is connect your spider to your computer. So I'll do that. So when your spider is connected to your computer, the first thing you want to do is make sure you put it up like so. One important secret or one important tip for you to calibrate perfectly, make sure you have your lights off or dim. Make sure you have no harsh light when you're color grading because the tendency is that when you're color grading, you want to see every colors in its natural form. So you don't want any light flashing on your screen. So it creates um, different colors, temperatures on, on your image because each light has a particular temperature. So flashing, uh, for example, a fluorescent light flashing on your screen might change your white to a little bit more blue and you might see the wrong color I don't know if it makes sense okay so the next thing you do is click next and you ensure that you're focusing on this screen you're on the screen you go next uh, if you have a laptop you go to laptop you have a desktop you go to desktop I have a desktop so I'll go next okay so the next um, last control just ensure that you have adjusted everything default on your screen then you go next yeah i've been calibrating my monitor so yeah it shows me recalibrate check calibrate or full calibrate i always advise you to do full calibration so i'll click here and go next and then it's gonna tell me place your spider here so right here i'll just open the spider like so you see and i'll place it right here like so And then I'm gonna click next. 
okay so yeah the spider will measure the lighting condition the the, 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 the the colors around your color grading room or whatever and then give you an accurate color for your screen so we'll just run along to the end so we don't waste much time okay so when it's finished you, it's gonna come like this you click finish okay my screen is calibrated already you're gonna click save I don't want to save this because I had already calibrated my monitor under a very good lighting conditions right now it's not a very good lighting condition so I cannot save it so just for tutorial sake you're gonna click save and then and that's it you have your screen calibrated perfectly well you can actually see the difference from before and after so that's how you calibrate your monitor. Thank you once more for watching. I hope you learned something from this. For those who learned something, thank you. Just like the video, share the video so other people can learn. For those who haven't learned anything, thank you for watching. Thank you for stopping by. For those who haven't subscribed yet, you can go ahead and subscribe so you receive every details of my channel very, very soon. So thank you. My name is Dr. Ken Stevens. Keep holding hands as we take another shot. <laughs>